Owens, Alicia Massey, and uh, Jessica Arundale, Eliza Pigstone, Francesca Baber, and a block with uh, Emily Manlove. And this the and the next in fact still all in the 208. So our first 33 swimmers in the event, all 208 times on the entries. Now those entry times can be set anything up to a couple of years or more previously. So it's not always representative or form or training especially over the last 18 to 24 months when there's been pool closures or delayed in reopening of pools there's been a real vast array in terms of uh, how much training can be done or capacity of training Baber of Flitic. Uh, a perfect half chevron on, on the far side from lane three out Alicia Massey, Isabella Woolard, Bryony Lowe, and Emily McWilliam. And some uh, synchronized swimming on the far four lanes. There's still a purple cap. And going to be your winner, Francesca Baber in Southern 206. Our penultimate heat in the women's 200 free from lane zero, Grace Pattle of Wickham District. In one, Emily Headley in Newcastle. In two, Annabelle Quinn, City of Milton Keynes. In three, Zara Bowman, City of Hereford. In four, Evangeline Belt, Plymouth Leander. In five, Julia Pavlik, Hillingdon Swimming Club. In six, Francesca Baber of Flissick Dolphins. In seven, Abby Salcom, City of Birmingham. In eight, Olivia Tom, York City Baths Club. And in lane number nine, Holly Stoker of Northumberland and Durham Performance Squad. Now, this is a change because we have no outright clear out like Lydia have we've had in the previous seats. This is a much, much tighter affair through 100. We do have a leader, of course, in uh, Francesca Baber on this occasion, 10202, but just under half a second. And we have had some fantastic second 100 swims throughout our opening six heats so uh, who's odds on favorite to uh, come through in the second half we'll find out in about 25 meters time as they turn for home for the final time all of these girls in the 16 year age category so this is a straight shootout to try and get a spot in the final with one heat to come that does contain a five more 16 year olds so potentially three or four spaces up for grabs in the final a little bit later on and Baber of Flittig a 135.77 to 150 meters she stretched the advantage to 0.6 of a second now and she is looking strong and as yet unchallenged into the final 25 meters closest to her are Emily Headley of Newcastle in one and in lane five Julia Pavlik of Hillingdon Baber's PB a 2.11.24 and she's possibly going to be beaten to the final mark here she is and she takes it 102.09.79 Penultimate final from our fourth day of competition here at Fonds Forge what a great time we are having I hope you're enjoying yourselves as well in the venue or at home and all the quick starts happening on the lower lane numbers, Megan Hansford of Tigers Jersey, 
Mabel Hayes, Anaconda and Anna Urin of City of Bristol all starting well. Great second 25 for Jessica Hum. Didn't have the greatest of starts, but she leads into the halfway stage. Every single girl in the pool separated by 0.89 of a second. What a way to begin the close of this session. And she just starts to pull away ever so slightly. Jessica Hum, she did win the gold in the 200 metre freestyle. Coached by Matt Turf in Brackle and Wokingham. 58-68 PB in the heat. She is going to double up and take a gold in the 100 free. 58-57-83. Don't want to do a disservice. Another PB. Number six, Jessica Turf and Jessica Baber, Eva Murray, Emma Crickshank, Lauren McRobbie, Julia Poundblake, Olivia Cooper, Lydia Swindle, and Kate Kennedy. In five, that is Lauren McRobbie of West Dorset with her fingertips in front of Blaine Ones, Francesca Baber of Flitic. They're the front two into the final five meters. Can't split third place. Can you split the top two? You can by only a tenth of a second. Lauren McRobbie takes it 27 24.